Thanks for tuning in to WSKI TV 17. It's time to take a check of your afternoon update brought to you by 45 North. Check them out this afternoon for some great apre or tonight for some great dinner or breakfast in the morning located right at the Sugarloaf Mountain Hotel. And you can find this and much more on your internet devices at WSKITV.com. Before Wednesday, we'll see clouds roll in, chance of some rain showers or some possible snow showers. As you can see right around the freezing mark up top with some very noticeable breezes up there. Down around the base, should warm up to the mid to upper 40s, and we will still feel that southeast to west wind bring in those warmer temperatures. And for Thursday, things cool back down. We'll see summer temperatures 15 to 19, base temperatures 29 to 33 with partly to mostly sunny skies. A great day out there, but with some elevated winds once again uh, hanging around. So want to be aware of that. As far as Friday goes, we'll see highs in the mid 40s with partly sunny skies. Looks like another system will move in Friday night into Saturday morning with cloudy skies and a chance of precip, uh, probably some uh, unfrozen precip down here on the base, and we'll see what happens up top of the mountain. 49 will do it for your high, and for Sunday, partly sunny skies with a high of 33 degrees and a low of 15. So up and down goes the weather and the temperatures. Bart Bertrand Interiors brings you a trail report. Check them out in Village West. 57 trails of skiing right on Wednesday morning. Nine lifts getting you those runs. 43 trails on the groomers list tonight. Loose granular, machine groom surfaces, as well as some uh, just variable conditions out and about on the mountain. Snubber, Sawduster, and Skidway. Those three lifts move you around the base area. If you're just learning to ski or ride, that's where you want to head. Double Runner East will get you a little higher on the hill. Uh, for runs down Boardwalk, Lower Winter's Way, Lower Narrow Gauge, which will all be groomed out first thing on Wednesday morning, so those should be very enjoyable. And also the Double Runner chair drops you off at Skyline. That gets you up to Spillway Crosscut, which allows you to branch out all across the mountain from the east to the west, and the Super Quad gets going as well at 8.30 to get you to a variety of mid-mountain terrain. King Pine and Whiffle Tree, those are the east side lifts. Higher up on the east side is the King Pine Lift, servicing some expert terrain. And Whiffle Tree, down lower, some great uh, intermediate terrain. Whiffle Tree is a nice, fast super quad to lap, especially if you're an intermediate skier. Some great stuff over there and some nice trails getting groomed out as far uh, over there, too. Timberline, that should get going at 9 a.m. on Wednesday morning. Winds, weather, and conditions. Uh Permitting, and as far as grooming, Lower Winter's Way, Candyside, Landing, Boardwalk, Birches, and Snowbrook around the base area, Central Mountain Trails like Timberline, Bridal Chain, Tote Road, King's Landing, and Hayburner, as well as Spillway and Sluice, all groomed out. Over on the east side, they hope to get to Hall back. They will get to Ram Down, Whiffle Tree, Pole Line, Springboard, Rollway, and Slasher. So lots of stuff over off of the Whiffle Tree Quad, and Scoot over on the uh, West side of the mountain will get groomed out as well. That's a great trail to take after you've uh, maybe grabbed a bite to eat and enjoyed Bullwinkles right on the top of West Mountain at the bottom of the Timberline Trail. Current conditions at the Sugarloaf Outdoor Center, things are still great down there, but the lodge is closed, so no service is going on down there. But you can use the trails. Just use the trails at your own risk, and uh, be sure to... Uh, just think before you sink if you're going to be out there with your uh, fat bike and whatnot. Clay Pottery Studios happens tonight, 5.30 to 7.30, to every single Tuesday night, and then Wednesday mornings from 10 o'clock to noontime. So a great uh, thing to do is head up, do some uh, open pottery studio, and then head over next door to the Sugar Bowl. Tonight you can enjoy Taco Tuesday or tomorrow Burger Wednesday, but they've got bowling lanes, virtual golf, an arcade, some great pub food, some great drinks, a great atmosphere, so go check out the Sugar Bowl. And know before you go, you can find us online at WSKITV.com, and as far as social media, Facebook, Twitter, as well as Instagram, the most informor information to improve your stay here. We are the insiders on the outside. Be sure to check out our Live quad cam on our website, as well as this latest local forecast, updated twice daily, and tons of videos of things to do to keep you busy while you're here in the main High Peaks region. And if you're a local business and want to get the word out about your business or your event, we are a full-service video production company to help you get the word out about your business or your event. 237-6895 is our phone number, or shoot us an email, wskitv at wskitv.com.